Hi friends welcome to spiritual motivation today i would like to reveal you about the secrets in breathing pattern you may wonder what is such a big secret that is existing in breathing pattern you are absolutely wrong my friends there are a lot of secrets hidden secrets involved in breathing pattern this breathing pattern has connection to your mind this breathing pattern will impact the qualities and characteristics of your mind as well as your body also my friends so let's get into the topic and let us understand the secrets today as we are all aware that we are breathing without awareness the breathing is happening automatically by using your subconscious mind but we are rarely conscious about the breathing the conscious breathing is one of the techniques in meditation about meditation we will understand later now in breathing pattern we have two nostrils technically in yogic language these two are called as ida nadi pingala nadi the left nostril is called ida nadi or chandra nadi the right side of the nostril is called surya nadi or pingala nadi let us call this as chandra and surya nadis if you observe keep your two fingers down to your nose about 3 4 times observe your breathing pattern observe your inhalation and exhalation pattern you will understand definitely that out of the two nostrils only one nostril will be flowing free and another nostril will be either half closed or even fully closed this you can observe but every time one nadi will be free other nadi will be closed or half closed and it will be switching to other nadi at a frequent intervals so let us understand how this will happen early morning 4 o'clock in brahmi muhurtam if you observe your chandra nadi will be dominant means your left nostril will be flowing freely and the right nostril will be either half closed or even fully closed and at 5 am in the morning this will become vice versa your surya nadi or right channel will be flowing freely and your left channel is going to be half closed or fully closed again at 6 o'clock this will turn to left chandra nadi again at 7 o'clock this turns to the right every hourly one interval right from 4 am in the morning your nadi will be switching without your knowledge without your interference how understand how this will happen let us understand my friends as i told you breathing will happen by using your subconscious mind without focusing on it it happens same way your subconscious mind depending on your body pattern depending on your body characteristics this will be switching from one nadi to another nadi now let's go more deeply and understand this secrets how your subconscious mind will do this at subconscious level left nostril is chandra nadi when the chandra nadi is dominant it means that chandra nadi has the characteristics and qualities of cooling your body system whereas the right channel of your nose which is called as surya nadi whenever surya nadi is dominant whenever surya nadi is flowing freely that time your body will get heat the name says surya means this channel has the quality of heating your body when breathing happens through right channel this will heat up your body when breathing happens to left channel this will cool down your body and not only that my friends chandra nadi is mainly connected to spirituality and your brain and even to your prana the people whose chandra nadi is dominant sometimes some people you may find most of the times one nadi will be dominant always if 
right channel which is nothing but surya nadi is dominant to anybody most of the times it means that their body is very heat body when your body is very heat it means that their surya nadi will be dominant most of the times you understand you touch your palm and you will feel the heat if your body is heat you can get the heat from palm so their surya nadi will be always dominant that is the main reason their body is a heat generated body and few people their body will be always cool the main secret is their chandra nadi will be dominant most of the time their left nostril will be flowing most of the times that is the reason their body is very cool body this is the top most secret my friends now if your body is heat body how to reduce the heat do pranayama with the opposite channel which is chandra nadi this will have a neutral impact if your body is a cool body do the pranayama with the opposite nostril called surya nadi this will generate the heat those whose right channel will be always active or most of the times active they are very aggressive people they are considered to be quick anger and anxiety people they are very tense in nature and they are like dominative nature those who has chandra nadi dominant in their breathing pattern they are very cool calm to some extent they are lazy lethargic and their body is prone to kapha chandra nadi dominant people body is prone to kapha and surya nadi dominant people their body is prone to pitta so surya nadi dominant people they have very good digestive system they have very good appetite whereas chandra nadi dominant people they can't digest the food so quickly they can't eat more they may feel indigestiveness in the stomach so when you do anulom vilom pranayam and nadi shuddhi this will balance both your cooling element as well as heat element chandra nadi as well as surya nadi both the nostrils this anulom vilom pranayam and nadi shuddhi with kumbhak will balance these two quality my friends if you want to balance your body please do anulom vilom pranayam and nadi shuddhi especially this chandra nadi dominant people they are spiritually highly advanced they are more into spiritual side chandra nadi is connected to spirituality this is top most secret my friends and there are lot more secrets more than this if you want to know please comment i will reveal more secrets very advanced secret very hidden secrets also i can reveal if you want please make it please drop a comment in the comment box thank you namaste